Okay, the Huskers are not at Big Ten Media Days this year, but Omaha Sports Insider Joe Quinn is, and he has the latest from Chicago. Hey, thanks, Phil. Yeah, obviously a very somber tone today here at Big Ten Media Days. Almost every single coach and player offering their thoughts, prayers, not only to Sam Fultz and his family, but the entire Husker family. And that led off with the very first session of the day this morning with Northwestern head coach Pat Fitzgerald. On uh, behalf of Northwestern, our football program, all of our players, uh, we'd like to express our thoughts and prayers to their families, Coach D'Antonio, Coach Riley, and, and the Spartan and Husker families uh, on their tragic loss. Uh, we recruited Mike and know him well, uh, and uh, just uh, sad, tragic uh, news, and our thoughts and prayers are with them. First, let me extend my condolences to uh, Nebraska and Michigan State for their tragic losses. Um, it's a sad day for those families there. Um, you know, I want to start by um, starting out by giving my condolences to both Nebraska, Michigan State, and the Fultz and Sad Sadler families. Uh, devastating to hear uh, about that news. Um, been through that in my coaching career as well, and um, you know, I don't think it's something you ever are prepared for or can handle. Um, but our support and condolences go out to them. Obviously, guys, no Huskers here today uh, at all. But uh, earlier today, preseason uh, players to watch list did come out. Two Iowa Hawkeyes on that list, including quarterback C.J. Beathard and cornerback Desmond King. Coming up a little bit later on tonight, uh, more tribute to Sam Foltz, including uh, Minnesota senior quarterback Mitch Leidner, who has unfortunately had to live this uh, experience uh, before. Reporting live from Chicago, I'm Joe Quinn, Omaha Sports Insider on KMTV Action 3 Sports. Okay, thanks, Joe. You can access Omaha Sports Insider 24 hours a day, seven days a week at omahasportsinsider.com, powered by KMTV3 and AM590 ESPN Omaha.